Representative Leb Sox's future in the Colorado legislature will be known soon. Thank you for joining us. I'm Andrew Hill. And I'm Shannon Ogden. The vote on expulsion will take place at the end of this week. And Denver 7's Mark Stewart's live at the state capitol. Mark kicking out a lawmaker. That is a rare move. And this is a big deal because the last time something like this happened was back in 1915. In order for Representative Lebsock to be removed, 44 out of 65 lawmakers have to agree. The vote again scheduled for Friday. Lebsock today standing tall. He says he will survive. So is there any credibility to any of these accusations? You know, I, I've been saying all along, um, I was, no. Democratic Representative Steve Lebsock is on the defense as his colleagues consider removing him from office. That's Why me. not just resign? I, because I'm not guilty. Lebsock, who is from Thornton, has been the focus of a probe since late last year. Five women accused him of sexually harassing them in 11 separate complaints. Among the accusers coming public, fellow Democratic Representative Faith Winter. She claims Lebsock made inappropriate comments to her at a 2016 party. If we don't move forward with this expulsion, we are sending a very dangerous message that when we put on this badge, that we are held above accountability and reproach. Lebsock was quick to criticize the independent investigation as biased and unprofessional. While he would not use the word conspiracy, he did suggest the move to oust him is a reflection of political power struggles at the Capitol. And over the next, over the coming weeks and months, um, the, the people of Colorado will have a greater picture about how the two-party system has failed us and how literally um, I'm being thrown underneath the bus. The last thing I was thinking of when I came forward was politics. My whole goal in coming forward was to make sure this behavior stopped and that women in this building felt safe and felt like their voices were heard. Now that this independent report has been complete, it's really at the center of this move to expel Representative Lebsock. It is supposed to remain secret, only available to members of the House of Representatives as well as the accusers. It's not supposed to be released. However, Representative Winter says she will consider revealing parts of it, making it public, depending on how things play out. So what is supposed to be secret may eventually be well known to all of us. We are live at the state capitol tonight. Mark Stewart. And for seven. Yeah, we'll be watching, that's for sure. Thank you, Mark. And at least three other.